Hello, my name's John, and I'm going to talk about tea. It may sound a bit ridiculous to talk about tea, but, you know, when you think like the humble nettle, yeah, which uh, you can you know, cure gout when, made in, when, when taken as tea, it's ridiculous, it's ridiculous, isn't it? These things are everywhere. These are, sorry, sorry. This is. Well, I decided I'm not, I'm not going to edit this. It's just going to come out kind of raw as I as I as I, as I, as I, do, as I do it. Man. But so here's the thing. It's like herbal teas we're talking about. I'm not going to talk about tea. Yeah, yeah. Not the well, the black stuff as well, I suppose. But you know, I just I, I just thought. It'd be interesting to just buy some, you know, just not buy, just to try herbal teas and see if you know, the, the, they're all that they claim to be. Okay, so the minute I'm drinking something called Cleaver's tea, because a long time ago, about maybe 20 years ago, I had lympho I had, you know, lymph lymphoma. Yeah, little little speck, little ridiculous, a little spot on my back just grew. Change shape and, and change, change well change shape but it didn't, wasn't, didn't and size a little bit. My, my, my girlfriend at the time noticed. So I went to the doctors, checked out yet. Yeah, turns out lymphoma. I had to cut the lymphoma. So I'm drinking this cleavers tea today because it it's a, it's a, it's it's one of the only herbs that actually drains your lymphatic system, cleanses you know. Cleanse a lot of stuff out, so you know. If you've got swollen joints, swollen, swollen glands after a, a cold or something, that's the thing. That's the thing to take. It will actually do it. But I'm just draining it just to make sure that <clears throat> you know, keep my lymphatic system healthy, and you know, don't want to get cancer again. To be honest, you now I'm drinking it, and it's um, it's it's an earthy taste. Yeah, it's a very earthy taste. I mean, when I was younger, for some reason, as a boy, as a boy, as a boy I would eat privet leaves. <laughs> Don't know why. And, you know, a lot of times I got chased off. Honestly, people were so precious then, you know. Stop eating my hedge and people would chase me away. But yeah, I mean, I mean and that's, actually, the majority of the teas I've tasted, the herbal teas all taste like hedge. But anyway, today it's cleavers. And, yeah, it's not an unpleasant drink. I'm, I'm trying to be sensible on I'm just I'm just doing one teaspoon for you know for three minutes and it seems to do the trick I mean I've been taking something called hyssop which my goodness <coughs> gets it does it shifts the phlegm it's really crazy I've always had like mm, between my um you know between my th you know my ears and my throat I've always had I've always had that thing you know Loads of phlegm there in that bit, <coughs> and I take that hyssop tea, and it, it seems to go for a bit. Google Eye Bright, and that's pretty good because I, I do. I mean, I do watch a lot of television. It's, it's just fantastic. Netflix and Disney Plus and all that. It's just amazing, isn't it? That you know, you, you just watch the kind of things you really like. But anyway, I do that. So you know, and it's like in it. Your whole life's about screens, really, when you think about it. Modern life is crazy, but it's all about screens. But this, this stuff called Eyebright will actually... Yeah, it does take the soreness away. It's really... It lasts... For me, it lasts a couple of days. But the loads of... I mean, this is just a trial run. Me yattering away, you know. When I come to do the thing properly, you'll actually see me, you know, pouring the tea and drinking the tea. And yattering on about it, but... There we go. So this is um this is it, but you know don't you know you don't need your caffeinated beverages. Although I do, I do love good I do love good quality coffee, you know. But you know but you don't need to limit yourself to those things. That there's there's, there's better things. Well, not better things, but I mean black tea has its place, doesn't it? Yeah, you know, certain. I think Oolong has some. <coughs> Oolong. Yeah, you know, certain black teas have some 
green tea of course has its own property which is the same plant as its own own properties doesn't it um, antioxidant properties that, that they talk about hmm but yeah anyway this is just I mean yeah basically I'm just trying to see if I can you know do it get a thing you know Yeah, record myself and then load it up to YouTube. But this is this this is just, you know, like the pilot, as it were. You know, Here, look, I'm, I'm grinning now. It's crazy. But let's let's um let's uh, see what happens with this. 